It's Learn TV. Hello, mga katropa. Welcome to my channel, Learn TV. Tulad ng uh, nabanggit ko sa previous video, ang uh, susunod na video natin ay ang pagpapaliwanag o uh, explanation uh, tungkol dito sa course of the sun. Uh, Ibe-breakdown natin ang uh, topic na ito at uh, bawat buwan uh, uh, anuin natin, uh, uh, i-explain natin para mas maliwanag ang ating pagkakaintindi tungkol sa kalendaryo. Tara, umpisahan na natin! Breaking down the course of the sun. Okay, so umpisa na po natin ano. Uh, this is chapter 72, okay? And uh, this is the course of the sun. At uh, yung first verses from verse 1 to 3 uh, is all about uh, the uh, uh, the knowledge that Uh, the archangel knows about the course of the sun. He said that there are six portals in the east and six portals in the west where the sun rises and sets. So basically, yun ang first three verses. Of uh, particular interest here is verse 3 where Enoch says that He saw six portals in the east and six portals in the west. Yung po yung patotoo ni Ino tungkol sa sinasabi ni Archangel Uriel. So ngayon naman mga katropa, I'm gonna try to explain to you how uh, uh, I think this uh, whole scenario works out. Uh, But in order for you to understand what I'm talking about, you will have to first watch the video previous to this. The previous video yung uh, tungkol sa ano sa course of the sun. Panorin mo na niyo yon. Uh, tapos bumalik kayo dito sa video na to. Pero kung napanood niyo na, uh, tuli tuli lang. So. Umpisahan natin sa paano nga ba nag-uumpisa ang araw ayon sa scriptures. So ito po yung snapshot nung uh, sunrise nung March 20, 2022. Uh, pinili ko po itong uh, uh, taon na to para madaling ma-explain. At uh, ito naman ang posisyon ng araw in relation to the fourth portal. At uh, makikita ninyo dito no, na ang araw ay nasa loob ng fourth portal at nakalampas na siya sa due east. Ito po ang uh, first day of the first month of the Enoch calendar. So, paano ko naman nalaman na yun ang posisyon ng fourth gate? Well, ganito po yan. Para maintindihan ninyo, kailangan alam ninyo yung verse tungkol sa 12th month, yung panghuling buwan. Ayun po sa scriptures, sa huling araw ng ikalabing dalawang buwan ng bawat taon, ang araw at ang gabi ay magkapareho ng haba. Ayun sa pananaliksi ko, ang tawag dito sa araw na ito ay ang Spring Equinox. So, ito po ang posisyon ng araw on the last day of the last month of the Enoch calendar. 
At uh, makikita ninyo na sa loob pa ng third portal ang araw. Ayon sa scriptures, ang araw na ito ay kung saan ang haba ng araw ay kasing haba ng gabi. Ito naman po ang snapshot ng uh, susunod na araw, March 19, 2022. At ito po ang uh, napag-aalaman ko na Spring Equinox. At uh, ito naman po ang relasyon ng araw patungkol sa third and fourth portal. At makikita ninyo na ang araw ay uh, nag intersect sa due east. Nakikita nyo ba yon? Okay, so ito naman po yung uh, uli no, itong snapshot ng March 18, 2022. Okay, ngayon naman ay babaguhin natin. March 19 naman. Okay. Yan, ito naman ang March 19, yung Spring Equinox. At tapos naman ay itong March 20. At iyan naman po ang snapshot nung uh, March 20. Oh, idoki. Dito naman sa uh, simulation na to ay uh, pinag-superimpose ko yung tatlong dates, March 18, March 19, at saka March 20 para makita ninyo o ma-imagine ninyo kung paano gumagalaw ang araw during sunrise at makikita ninyo din dyan da March 19 ang uh, araw ay hindi pa fully uh, enclosed sa fourth portal kita nyo ba yon ang March 18 sa Gregorian calendar ay ang huling araw ng uh, Enoch calendar or uh, the 12th month and the uh, 31st day. Yan ang 364th day. Ang 365th day, March 19, ay hindi po binibilang dahil ang araw ay hindi pa nakakatawid sa fourth portal. So, again, no, no? yung uh, 365th day, ang spring equinox ay hindi binibidang kasi hindi pa nakakatawid yung araw sa fourth uh, portal and ma- kung maaalala ninyo no ang araw o ang taon ay nag-uumpisa ng pagpasok ng araw sa fourth portal and in this case March 19 ay hindi pa nakakatawid ng husto ang araw sa due east sa port portal ibig sabihin ni nangangalahati pala ang siya so yung susunod na araw pa kung saan uh, nasa loob na siya ng port portal yun ang first day of the year okay mga katropa so ngayon naman ano i-map out natin sa horizon okay ang pagsikat ng araw uh, throughout the year you know every month The first day of the first month, i-map out natin siya at nasaan yung position niya on the horizon. Okay, using, of course, my calendar, the one that I uh, made up. Okay, so let's start. Okay, so umpisa natin dito sa Stellarium Software. Okay, at uh, tama natin to. Ano 
the best way is Uh, before we start with this simulation, uh, I'd like to point out no, na sa scriptures, iba po ang oras sa scriptures. Sa uh, ating panahon ngayon, ano, in recent times, we are in a 24-hour period. Every day is 24 hours, right? But in the scriptures, the day is uh, divided into 18 parts. Okay, so uh, a ninth part, an eighth part, see? So an hour is, uh, I mean, a 24-hour period is actually an 18-hour period if you think about it. But, you know, different lengths of hours, right? So just to point that out to you, uh, that you're not gonna see hours here. You're gonna see, you're gonna hear parts or an eighth or a ninth okay yung fraction of a day so the day is divided into 18 parts okay ayos na yan all right and then um uh lagyan natin ng filter yan and then put natin yung uh, control ng date and time and we are going to go to March uh, 20 March 20 2022 okay and uh, sunrise okay So, post na rin sandali. And, okay, so, ito po yung ano, sunrise on uh, March 20, 2022. At makikita ninyo, uh, nakatawid na ang araw sa uh, due east. Okay. At, uh, So, so uh, umpisa na natin siyang i-map out ano. So this is uh, the first day of the first month which is uh, March 20, 2022. Okay. Now let's go to the next one. April 19. Okay. So let's go to April 19. In, and let's put the simulation on uh, sunrise okay so ito po ang sunrise on April 19 2022 which is the first day of the second month in the uh, Enoch calendar okay next day is May 19 okay, May 19 and let's bring down the sun to sunrise oh. okay so ito naman ang May 19 ah uh, 2022 which is the first day of the third month next let's move to the next month uh, June 19 okay May June 19 let's bring it bring it down to sunrise okay oops okay So, ito naman ang sunrise on June 19, uh, 2022, which is the first day of the fourth month. Okay, so next date. 
Next day, it should be. Uh, July 19. July 19. Let's bring the sun to sunrise. Oops. Okay. So, ito naman ang sunrise on July 19. 2022 which is the first day of the fifth month moving on uh, it's gonna be August 18 August 18 okay uh, let's bring it up okay So, ito naman po ang sunrise on August 18, uh, 2022, which is the first day of the sixth month. Next date, September 18, 2022. September 18, 2022. Bring the sun up for sunrise. You. Okay, so ito naman po ang uh, September 18, 2022, which is month 7, the first day of the seventh month. Okay, next month is the 8th month and this is October 18. October 18, let's bring the sun up. Oop. Okay, so ito naman po ang ah uh, ah uh, ano ito? October 18, 2022, which is the first day of the 8th month. Okay, next one. It's gonna be uh, November 17. So, November 17. Bring the sun down. Okay. Okay, so ito naman po ay ang November 17, 2022, which is the first day of the ninth month. Moving on. The next date, December 18. Okay, so ito naman po ang December 18, 2022, which is the first day of the 10th month. First day of the 10th month. Okay, next one. The 11th month is uh, January 17. January 17. 2023 na po ito. Okay? 2023 na. Sa uh, Gregorian calendar. And ito po ang sunrise. Okay? On the uh, the 17th of January 2023 which is actually the first day of the 11th month. Okay? Now, let's move on to the 12th month in the Enoch calendar, the last month. And it starts February 16. February 16. And let's put the 
Sundown for sunrise. Okay. Uh, yan po ang date na February 16, 2023 na. And this is the first day of the 12th month. Ang kahuli-hulihang uh, uh, buwan sa taon ng kalendaryo ni Inok. At uh, of course, na talakay na rin natin no, on the last day of this same month, March 18, okay, uh, makikita ninyo na uh, yun po yung uh, day na uh, ano, uh, ano ba tawag doon? Yung last day na March 18, eto, and uh, oops at ito po yung March 18, 2023 last day of the Inok calendar lagi po yung ganyan na ang uh, araw ay nasa uh, third portal on that last day at patawid na siya sa fourth portal okay so yan po So, ayan, na-map out na natin sa horizon ang sunrise. So, ang gawin naman natin ngayon ay pagkabit-kabitin natin yung mga snapshots. Tingnan natin kung ano ang uh, makikita natin.
So, uh, nakabalik na po tayo dito sa last day of the year which is uh, one or two days away from the beginning of the next year. At makikita ninyo dito sa last day of the year na ang araw ay nasa third portal pa rin. So there you go mga katropa, yan ang breakdown ko tungkol sa Inok calendar. I hope you like my presentation. If you have any questions, please write a comment down below and I will try to answer back as soon as I can. Uh, please like, comment, and subscribe and I'll see you on the next video. Thank you! Don't forget to click on the notification bell. Thank you again for watching. Please support our channel by liking, subscribing now. It's free. Yeah, mga katropa, hanggang dito na lang. Like, share, and subscribe. Thank you.